Hi everyone, um, today's video is an update on my weight loss so I can happily report that I am down 16 pounds in total. I'm really proud of myself. Um, since the last video I've lost an additional um, seven, I think nine pounds um, and lost two inches on the bust um, or is it two inches? No, I think I've lost an inch on the bust, um, lost maybe about an inch and a half on the waist and two and a half inches on my hips so I'm really really pleased with that progress. Um, it's been a hard hard slog over the last um, month and a bit um, since the last video. I lose weight, put it on, lose weight, put it on. So in total I, I probably should have been down about 30 pounds but because of the you know for the fluctuations in my weight um, I've really struggled and my most difficult um, times for controlling my weight is definitely um, you know, um, around that sort of time of the month, you girls know what I'm talking about. Um, when you're just quite hormonal and you just want to eat a whole bunch of like comforting foods, like lots of carbohydrate rich foods. Luckily for me, I don't really have a sweet tooth. So I do luckily avoid things like cakes and sweets and things like that. But not that I won't eat them. I'm just saying that they don't really do it for me. My thing is definitely carbohydrate rich food so generally pizza pasta um chinese food those kinds of uh, things and i really struggle to control myself around the, those times of the month um the other thing is that when people when i when i go out to dinner with either friends or with work colleagues or sometimes suppliers will take take us out to dinner or to lunch um and if somebody else is paying trust i am ordering filet mignon okay <laughs> like the finest food on the menu if you're paying i'm eating and i'm eating anything that you know i normally wouldn't eat because i can't afford it um but on your dime sure why not um so i'm, I'm really i really struggle with those um, times so it then means that you know i have to go to the gym and work really really hard to get the weight off and i'm one of these people that d does tend to weigh themselves every day um, I weigh myself every day um, during the week when I go to the gym. So I go to the gym usually about five times a week, unless I'm out of the office and I can't get to the gym. Um, but yeah, usually five times a week. And I generally don't weigh myself at the weekends, but definitely during the week. Um, so, but that really helps to control my, control my, um, my, my weight increase and weight loss. Because at least if I have like a really bad day, um, the next day I'll see it on the scales. I mean, it's literally that quickly. So then it then forces me to work extra hard to get that weight off. The other thing I'm using is um, MyFitnessPal. MyFitnessPal is a really, really great app. If any of you are trying to lose weight, I really suggest using that. I'm not one of these people that can do one of those Atkins diets or like, you know, no carbohydrate diets. I just can't manage that like I love carbs so I prefer to use the MyFitnessPal app um, can count my calories count my um, and then I have my obviously my, my net calories are 1200 calories a day sometimes I'm under sometimes I'm way over but you know at least I'm able to control um, within that sort of parameter of, um, of calories um, what else um, I'm going to show you just now um, the uh, a visual of um, the the weight loss I'll measure myself and then you can see whether or not you can see any um, in decrease I'm really pleased as well that um, now I'm finding things inside my work wall inside my wardrobe that I couldn't wear because they were too small and now I can fit in them and, and it's really great because um, obviously with the saving for the wedding I don't have any money well I do have money but I just don't have money to spend on anything really other than the wedding so um, it's really meant that I can't really go shopping and um, going inside my wardrobe and finding things that I can wear again is just amazing because, you know, now I feel like I'm going shopping all over again inside my wardrobe for free, for free. Um, and then also I'm going to um, try and um, customise a few of the clothes that I've got um, to, you know, maybe make them a little bit more edgy. Um, Try and accessorize a little bit with um, some uh, African uh, fabric prints, um, but I'll show you that in another in another video. Um, but yeah, so I'm really really pleased, and I'll just um, show you right now um, my my sort of 360 360 of my weight loss. Oh, I can't wait till I get down to the right weight, like my ideal weight, which is um, 120 pounds. Um, so that's a few pounds, <laughs> more than a few pounds away. I won't tell you how many. Um, so ideally, I'd like to get down to 120 pounds. And when I'm there, trust me, I'm not wearing clothes, okay? You're gonna have to beg me to wear some clothes. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, okay, so I'll show you now. Right, so remember last time I was 37 inches, so I'm now 36 inches, so that's an inch lost. 
really proud of myself there. Um, around my waist, I have dropped about, I would say, two inches or maybe 1.7 inches, but maybe just say two inches. I was 33 inches before, and at that time when I measured myself, I had eaten, so it wasn't first thing in the morning, but this is first thing in the morning after I've just had some water. So really pleased with that progress. Um, around my hips, my hips have always been enormous. I've always hated my hips and my butt, which always has always been in the way, but I guess that's just um, the way I was built. But um, lost weight around my hips as well, which is really where I measure my progress. So that's like my barometer of um, progress for me. And down about 1.7 inches around my hips. So at one point I was 47 inches, if you can believe that. Well, I can, because <laughs> my clothes told me that. Um, so really happy with my hips. And uh, here's a 360 view of um, of me. If you can see any difference, then obviously let me know, because I certainly can feel it in my clothes. And my um, Batman wings, or wing bingo wings as I call them, are disappearing as well. So body's transforming and looking much better than before. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye.